howdy everyone it's your pal misty get ready to sit back relax and enjoy i'm not wearing the same clothes as yesterday yesterday is also today but you're getting videos on two different days with me wearing the same clothes because i wanted to be sure and put out a video this morning so that one was done edited and uploaded today this one will be done, edited, and then uploaded tomorrow. But I'm on my way home. And an interesting thing happened at work today. Something that I hadn't really thought of or noticed until it happened. Um, I got angry. Like, big mad. And that just doesn't happen to me very often. It's... I get frustrated a lot because people, I don't know how many times you want me to say the same thing before you're going to decide to listen. And that's not on me. I've escalated. Did you tell anybody? I told everybody, including you and your boss. So I don't know how you missed it. So that can be very frustrating. Well, I feel like this air is just not even on. Um, we're going to have to turn it up, people. The air may be getting a little bit louder. I'm going to talk a little bit louder to compensate. Anyway, so it's a very long story that's not very important about a whole bunch of people not listening. And then we're all on a call together. And then you just go and do totally something not at all that was discussed or planned and just really messed a whole bunch of things up a whole bunch of things and so I got angry I got very not at any person I got angry at the situation and do you know what I realized about it I don't like it I didn't like it at all I went for I'm like I have to go for a walk and they're like okay <laughs> go for a walk because I was I don't even get to talk to these people in person it's all just over the phone or via Skype so I had to go take a walk Anger is a very um, draining emotion. Like, I wonder sometimes, I know there are people out there who are perpetually unhappy, and I feel like that cannot be a fun life to live, but there are some people who are perpetually angry, and I mean, I see why they do horrible things to themselves or other people because it's not a fun emotion um and then I felt really bad because I had let I felt like I had let them get the better of me you know it's like when somebody treats you bad don't treat them bad back don't stoop to their level be better than they are but as haha as Kristen Hampton would say she gave me a shout out today on her video I was very excited and I needed it because I had just been angry and then she came on and then I watched it and she's being a flashlight I need to be a flashlight because at the time I was not a flashlight I was very angry and it was so draining and I didn't like it and it accomplished nothing except for making me feel bad so I'm not gonna let them do that to me anymore I mean they'll still frustrate me and it'll they'll still do things that boggle my brain because I don't understand why you're doing that. It doesn't make any sense. But whatever, right? I can deal with all that. People at four-way stops. It's not It's not my time. Don't flash your lights at me. You know, stuff like that. I don't know where my umbrella is. It's raining. Who knows where my umbrella is? Somewhere where I'm not, right? All those kind of things. That's just me being really frustrated. But not angry. Angry is different. And, I mean, a few people have seen it, and they know when it happens, and it's not nice, and it's not friendly. Um, and you really don't want to meet me or make me be in that state of being, because it's no fun for you either, I can guarantee you from what I've been told. But, I just wanted to come on here today on this brief little ride home, hoping that we don't overheat. Oh, I have a soda. I was like, something was making weird noise in my car. I had a soda from our client visit yesterday, and I forgot to take it inside the house. So I guess it's getting way hot, and it's going to explode here in a minute. That'll be fun. I'll 
to, I'll take it inside, so it won't explode. No, nope, don't you worry about that. <sighs> so once again, we've had a whole conversation and we have not talked about a topic, but today's topic I will steal because you really just should be a flashlight. Be a flashlight. Be somebody else's light. If they don't have one. Be your... Okay. Oh, look at that. What do you know? It already exploded just a, just a little bit. It's hot outside. That's what has happened. It is hot. It is August. D okay, Grant. Random rambling with Misty. Are you ready? Let's go. So yesterday night I was tired and wanted to go to sleep and I was like, you know what? It's nine o'clock. I'll go ahead and walk Barnum now so I can kind of relax before I go to bed. Nine o'clock. I go outside. It was hot. Oh, it was so hot. See, just for clarity again, this is just frustration, not anger. Um, but it's so hot. Why is it so Oh, and then I realized it's that time. I always think of July as being so hot because that's when I go on vacation and spend the most time outside for the most number of days in a row and it's hot during vacation. It's only 100 degrees, sometimes more. But then I forget that the really the hot month is August. I mean, like I don't forget because I was mad we couldn't have dress down this month, but I don't make the rules. Say I was mad, I wasn't mad, whatever, but I wear pants. But I would like to wear shorts because it's cooler. But I was out last night in shorts and a t-shirt walking the dog nine o'clock, and do you know what happened? I was sweating. That's right. I was sweating. Just walking the dog. Just not like a not like a brisk walk. Not you know, like a run. Just a, just so just a walk and stop and pee and walk and stop and raise your leg and not have anything come out and walk and stop and then just you run out of ammo and you just keep peeing on everything. Barnum hikes his leg to everything and pees only the first time. But he's a dog and I'm used to that. And although I don't understand it, I know that's our life together. But it was hot outside at night, in the middle of the night. So oh you know what else speaking of let's just talk about things that irritate me today. Speaking of irritated, <laughs> the car overheated. Not the car, the phone overheated because it's in the car and it's hot. It's 107. Evidently, it doesn't like 107. It can't last. It lasts a long time. Phone. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be saying that about you, but that's because I blew extra air too. Um, but so I was. I think the last thing it said was I was going to talk about stuff that's irritating me. Um, so another thing that's irritated me is my Crocs. Dang it. I'm so upset and sad and all those things, everybody. Because remember, I don't know if y'all watch. I don't know if y'all watch that episode or not. If y'all watch that episode or not. But I don't even know what episode it was. But I mentioned that my Crocs, I'd left them in my car. And then... I could barely fit them on my feet after leaving them in the car for a couple of days. Them, them suckers still don't fit. Oh, they're way too small. They're like at least, at least a size smaller. Like when I jammed them in my feet in them the other day, I didn't have the backs on. They're the like, it's my R2D2 Crocs. I don't know if I said that originally. So I would be more hurt if it was my Mickey Crocs because I wear those probably 75% of the time because most of the stuff at work matches blue and they're blue. Blue, you see? Uh, blue. Um, so they match. So I wear those most of the time. But I do wear the, the gray ones because I have some gray shirts and things like that. But they don't fit. <laughs> I'm so sad. I've been looking up ways to try to undo it, but it, I can't find anything. So I don't know what to do about my Crocs. And I love them. And, I mean, I got them on special, but there no, it wasn't nothing. One of y'all's turns right then. <laughs> that was a four-way stop. Speaking of things that irritate me, four-way stops all day, every day, those irritate me. People just don't understand the rules. 
or they understand them and they just don't do them at all because they're in a hurry I guess so let's just put everybody up for being hurt on accident because you was in a hurry that's how I see it <laughs> But my Crocs don't fit, and I'm so mad about it. I'm not angry, but I'm mad about Really? Oh, there we go. My little clicker wasn't working for a second. I think the battery's going out on it. But, so, if you have any suggestions for how to make my Crocs not a size smaller, or if you were, like, a size 8 and would like some R2-D2 Crocs, I guess, let me know. Hit me up. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm going to need to buy another pair, but I don't know if they sell them. I'm going to be so, oh, I'm really going to be hurt if they don't even sell them anymore. Oh, I better not even look. I don't know. Not today. Not today, Misty. Don't look today. Today, it'll just hurt your feelings even more. And they've already made you angry today. I, I was so upset with myself. I think I got more angry that I got angry that I let somebody do that to me. Because I don't mind being frustrated. That's kind of fun. A little bit. I like not knowing exactly what's going on. And people being Let me clarify. Let me just clarify that statement. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like when people don't know what's going on. I'm used to it. And I think it's funny sometimes. We'll turn this down just a little bit because now we're under shade. So hopefully we won't overheat as much. Car's down to 104. Um, so we didn't talk about a topic today. And I got angry. And I didn't like it. And I got a shout out. And I liked it. And you should be a flashlight. So, just like Kristen Hampton says, be a flashlight. Pew, pew. Shine your light for others to see. And share your stories for others to hear. And know that sometimes people are going to make you angry. Try not to let them. Because then they win. Try to stay calm and happy and serene. And all those kind of fun things. So, that's going to be it for today. I hope y'all are having a great week. We should be about halfway through it now. If you're following up uh, as I post these videos, it'll be Wednesday for you. Wait. Yep. Nope. It'll be Wednesday for you. It's only a day later, too, and that took me way too long to figure out. Today's Tuesday. There may be a whole couple of days where I don't know what day it is coming up real fast as these three launches get closer, but... Hang in there with me. And then, when your car goes out again because you thought you'd be smart and turn the airbag down, it's back up. You don't even have to be upset because you're just happy all the time. Even though you have to restart this video three times. It's not a big deal. So, like I always say, when I remember, like this video if you haven't already. Please subscribe if you know how. If not, reach out to somebody who can help you. And let me know down below, I don't know, what? What do you want to tell me? Tell me something down below that I can remember for the next time people try to make me angry. So that I won't have to be. Because we will not let them win. Pew, pew, pew. See y'all real soon.